we all know what happened to Professor George Saitoti and Orua Ojode. The plane which was carrying the two crashed and both of them died. But there have been a lot of speculations about the cause of that plane crash. And yesterday, Mike Movie Sonko seems to have a bit of details, more details, on what really caused that plane to crash. So I want you to listen to Mike Sonko because he's suggesting that individuals at State House or around the, what he calls the system were responsible for that crash and is actually going ahead to claim that Mute Iringo, who was I think the, the, the principal secretary for interior, was supposed to travel with the two. But he was called that something was going to happen and he didn't really travel with them. So listen to Mike Sonko making such grave comments. Ready. Okay, welcome back uh, for part two of our program, Karibuni uh, Kwa Sonko TV. So our part one, I was just trying to express myself that I've been enjoying very cordial relationship with uh, my women there. So, he decision yaki ya kwenda kuni attack Madaraka Day, she was sent by somebody within the system. And the system thinks, the day I went to St. Stephen's Church for prayer day, for uh, uh, ahead of the Labor Day celebration, ili sikukuya wa fanikazi, walithani I was under instructions from Deputy President or Tim Tanga Tanga to attack those two corrupt leaders of Kieleweke who are there. But always, I have my facts uh, correct before nilopoke ropoke kama mtu um, mjinga. Yeah, kupata facts exactly right. Now, I want that to be an, an issue. Nume say kumgira tena mambe women rep. Alini accuse falsely. Nume come out clearly. I always defend myself with documents. Nume onesha ticket is nandega na kila kitu. So, to me now, that is an, an issue. Uh, and if it is a matter of apologizing, let us start by apologizing. Because even me as a person, I bet it is wrong to release some of the sensitive conversations between me and I. That's when we release conversation in relation to Kazi. Yeah? To confirm that we are in talking terms. Sindio, those who are criticizing me, I want you to put yourself into my shoes, my wife's shoes, my family uh, shoes. I'm somebody's husband. In some of the conversations, which I'll not release until the women rep is there, Ali Nihita Kwa Intercontinental Hotel, Kwa Room. Some area and Anipigia Kini Tongoza, oh, Governor, I must love you more. Nini Nina, I told her, I have a wife. So, Pia Nini Mudu Mimi Nikona family, Nikona Bibi, Mambai ni Mama Kama Nini. Anyway, you may, you may, you may shout. Now, why I was talking about the system? The problem started during that day, yeah, Kanisa. Then the financial of Kelereke, who is based at the OP, and you know him, and I do not fear him, who was mentioned in the corruption saga of uh, Ugandan embassy, the building the, 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 the government was acquiring, and around 450 million was misappropriated. He also he was also a beneficiary of this uh, of this uh, loot. At some point, the Wandai Committee in the National Assembly summoned him to come to come and testify because during that time when the government lost this money, he was the PS for uh, foreign affairs. But he, he 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 never honored the summons to death. He has never appeared before the parliamentary committee, the Wandai Committee, to respond to those particular questions which were raised, so he's not above the law. But he's the main sponsor who misled my women rep without facts to come to the uh, Uru, I mean, Pangani uh, Madaraka Day celebration Uda kutapika ile mambo alitapika mbele ya watu aki expect me to nyamaza. So I had the right to respond and to reply and in my response, my women rep alika sirika na kaenda. Mimi tu ni nisema, mimi si mwana yako, na shika si msele unataki. Na hiyo ya matusi. Na hiyo ya matusi. Na I want to tell FIDA and, uh, and, and Nation newspaper who are saying sivini me defy chapter 6 of the constitution 
at his I should be arrested. If you don't know law, you feed the lawyers. Come, I, 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 I teach you some law. I might sponsor you. The police have the most money Sharia can pay for you. Uh, full cause, more funding Sharia. See what they may breach anything. So one strange thing about this system. Since we are going to change the amount of Kumaliza, it will not go the Saitoti way because the dark days are over. And let the last minister, leader, to be assassinated because of poor politics be Saitoti. The games the system is trying to play on me, I'm not a fool, my friend. The same, 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 same day, a day before Madaraka Day, five armed goons, armed with machetes, pangas, bows, and arrows, came to my residence, my other residence. I've got a small residence in Upper where I have a private office. At times when I'm tired, I just relax at that uh, private uh, residence of mine. Around midnight on 30th of June, five armed goons came. Wakaruka Okuta, Namapanga. So people realize we have compound and we have got the, the clip of those goons and uh, what transpired. We had to shoot in the air to disperse them. Watano Wakaruka Okuta. Umoja, Akanguka Chini. Mutukamuliza Nini Unafata Pala Masila, Namapanga, Namanini, Namanini. Atuambia ni kutumwa. Atuko wamuliza uli tumwa na kina nani? Zama hitu wametumwa, ako biyashara, nini nini, sijua mekuja uh, kuiba. He was arrested. Atupele kwa Capitol Hill Police Station. Anaitu wa Nicholas Mulua Lysia. On 30th of May, she was, uh, he was arrested. 31st of May, a day to Madaraka Day, alipele kwa kotini. And this is the charge sheet. He's still, he's still in custody. This year, he's still in custody. Then the same day, walipotuma pasari kuja kunisomea na makosa mbaya kuna, and I was shocked because I was in good terms with my sister. Same night, what ya imambo mnasikia sibiati ya my daughter Jana? Same night, on first, kwa mkia second usiku, at Memphis in Kasarani, Malik Rupana Mpira, my daughter stays in area here, that in, that in, that in estate. And Kwa Nangalia Mpira, na Senator Walamu, na other people. Hapo, mademu, mamputu ya mtaya kawaida. Na jomitu ya kwa grown up, ameza, chiza kutu nituwa niya, lazima kwa naraiti ya freedom yake. So I was shocked. After a day, eight goons, armed with pangas and machetes. Now, there was a police woman, who was involved, and I lent my daughter to those people. As my daughter was going to the toilet, they wanted to attack my daughter. She screamed. Then the people who were watch football at Memphis came to the rescue of my daughter. In the process, the senator alikatokato na na mapanga. That was on first usiku kwa mkia second around saa saba hapo sanane. My daughter reported the matter for Kasarani Police Station uh, on November 22nd of the same night. And uh, investigation in Ifanyo, one, David Combo Lucas was arrested. The senator is in ICU. But the system plan, this guy has been released na cash bill ya 20,000 bado katakata senator walamu na mapanga the guy is free another guy has been arrested today who was armed even uh, that material day so I want to tell the system my friend munaza kuchorea watu batuwezi kuchorea watu kila siku we know even the issue of silence sijui barua we know deputy president president that is okay Mr. Zimon Tebena Sayden, you saw me during the Madaraka Day celebrations. I went to the border border. I will lose the border border. We know what you are after. You guys remember how Saitoti died. Saitoti was going to a fundraising uko Homa Bay, na Ojode. And they were supposed to go with Mutairingo, wakirushwa na uyu Captain Mutwamba. What happened? Mutairingo was told, toka kwandege, something is going to happen. And that's how Saitoti died. 
and President Uhuru is not involved in this. It is the system that was here at that time that killed Saitoti. Because the system had their candidates, Moses uh, uh, Musali Mudavadi. And the system, Wali Kubalena Wakasema, we cannot have two candidates from the same system, from the same government. Because there was no way Saitoti could run and Mudavadi, Mudavadi could run. And Uhuru didn't play a role in this. He was not even aware. At times when the system want to finish you, even the president will not be involved. Even the allegations have leveled here. The president is not aware. But the system is aware. Even this Mambo Gold, we know. Stop playing with Kenyans. We have got confessions even from Zaire himself. We know who, uh, 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 which senior officers are involved in this. So much of the system is here. System to is a deal. The dark days are over. Yeah? So I told you to come to your mission in Kuwa. And we are coming for you people. We know them. Yeah? They're not in government. But what happened that time should not happen now. Yeah? Kenyans are watching you people. Yeah? Kumagamoka damu. Kuwa uwa watu viongozi. Nani alisema watu flani ndo wamezaliwa na wamepua kipua wa kuwa maraisi kwa inji peke yao? Yeah? The right time is coming. Kenyans are watching you. The so-called system. Stop playing with Kenyans. How many people will you kill? Yeah? How many people will you kill? We know how the system works and we are going to deal with it. That's the end of part two. We are going to part three.